All right, Bolo Buddies, are you ready to see what I have been working on? This is not a Bolo video, however... It's my Bolo, it's my be on the lookout. It's something that I have been on the lookout for that someone found for me and I'm gonna tell you the whole story. But shout out to Miss Jill. Thank you so much for my cute little owl earrings. She was over at my Whatnot show and she bought these and she gifted them to me. So I love them, they're so cute. They're shiny with feathers and ah! So just a little hint on what this video is about. It's about owls. <laughs> I'm so excited to show you guys this. All right, let's get started. Oh my goodness, it's here. I'm so excited. Let's open it up. Let's see if it made it in one piece. She's like, it's gonna be there tomorrow. I really hope it made it in one piece. And I'm like, oh my goodness, me too. I'm so nervous. Ooh, the anticipation. Can anybody guess what's in this box? This is a personal purchase. And my friend, Mindful Recycle Terry, messaged me and she was going to an estate sale. Oh my goodness, look at all these bubbles. <laughs> Oh, it's got to be safe, right? She was going to an estate sale and it was jam packed full of owls. And she sent me pictures and I said, look and see if you can find me a lamp. And guess what she found me? But not only did she find me a lamp, but you're going to have to see what else she found me. Oh my goodness. This is like a whole roll of bubble wrap. Oh my goodness. I can't wait to see it. All right, let me get it out of here. What? I was going to stop and just unpack it, but I was like, you know, this is probably educational for somebody who wants to ship a lamp because I would have no clue. So here's the lampshade. And she's like, do you want the lampshade? And I'm like, yes, I want the lampshade. That's what I need. And this is like a heavy duty, really nice lampshade. Um, it's going to be perfect. All right, my phone. I had to go charge the battery. So another huge piece of bubble wrap. Oh my goodness, look at all this bubble wrap. Bubble wrap, bubble wrap, bubble wrap. Oh, it's inside here, I can't wait to see it. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Is the anticipation getting to you guys? Oh, there's the topper, there's the topper. Ooh. Oh, I see it, do you see it? Oh my goodness, here's the top of the lampshade. Just to show you, she's got this all wrapped up like that, okay? I'm gonna unwrap it and show you what we got. It's, look at this owl, and it's a lamp. But the best part that I didn't know when I saw it is it is the Snowy Owl Porcelain Lamp by Raymond Watson, 1987, the Franklin Mint. And if you don't know, Franklin Mint <laughs> is a bolo. Um, I got this lamp for $30. Oh my goodness. Look at it. It's so cute. And then I'm going to decorate the lampshade with owl brooches. It's going to be amazing. All right. Look at this. These are, um, peanuts. Wow. I've never seen those. Padlock. Huh. It's like peanuts inside. I'll tell you what, that really is not messy. Uh-oh, what's this? This goes to something. Does this go in the base? I'll have to figure out what that goes to. And then the, I want to say the best part. I'm so excited about this. So I told her what I was doing and she's like, oh my gosh, Courtney, they have a ton of owl brooches. I'm like, get out of town. I'm like, find out how much. I have a hundred and thirty, one hundred and thirty owl brooches in here. So we're gonna go through these together. I don't know. I she sent me pictures, but it was really just a picture of a table full of owl brooches. So I really am not even certain, like if anything's signed, if anything's amazing. But oh gonna go through this together it's gonna be so fun does anybody else love owls i am so excited terry thank you so much you are the best everybody please subscribe to um 
Terry over at Mindful Recycle. She is an incredible big money bolo finder and she found me a little treasure. Wasn't that nice of her? And guess what? She packed it up and shipped it and did all of that for me. What a gift. What a sweet, sweet gift. It's owl time. It is owl time. Here's the first one. And some of these, depending on how many I need for my lamp, I'm not really sure. I may end up selling some of them to make back some of the money that I spent on this. This is gonna be an expensive lamp. Oh my goodness. Oh wow, look at that one. How fun are these? Oh my goodness, incredible, incredible. Look at this guy, he's super old. That's what I loved is I could tell from the picture that she sent me that some of them were older and some of them were more modern. This one is not a brooch, it's a pendant. So I will more than likely sell that. This is a stick pen. Oh my goodness, it's so darling. You guys, there's 130 in here. Look at this. Wow. This one's broken. Wow. It's so pretty. Oh my goodness, you guys. Made in Russia. Wow, 14 of 250. Oh, it's beautiful. Ah, look at that guy. He is signed Jene, G-E-A-N-N-E. -N -N -E. Is that what that would spell? Look at this. I love them. Oh my goodness. Okay, at the end, you have to tell me which one's your favorite. Uh -huh. It's gonna be impossible to decide, right? Oh, look at this one. This person loved owls. She sent me a picture. I mean, it was out. There were owls everywhere. Oh, look how pretty that is. The purple and the teal. There were owls all over this house. Oh, I wonder what that's made of. Look at that old one. Wow. Some sort of plastic. Ooh, everybody say it with me. Ah. <laughs> oh my goodness. That one's missing some stones. This one's signed JJ. Pretty. I like the pretty blue eyes. Cute. What's this one? Oh, is that shell? Is that mother of pearl? Wow. That's beautiful. This guy. He is marked something. I can't read it. That one looks pewter, Night Owl, 1989. Look how great these are. These are so great. I love them so much. So I was looking for owls and I was starting to source them and it was a lot of money trying to pick up individual brooches. So I was able to buy these all in one big bundle. Oh, this one looks like it's signed too can't read it, but look at that. Wow. Wow, wow. Is that an owl or a bird? <laughs> I don't know, but it's signed also. This is going to be a long video, guys. You may have to come back. And if you don't like owls, you may not even want to watch. But I am so excited. I am seeing these with you guys. This one is Liz Claiborne for the first time. 
And I don't even know if Terry actually like looked through and looked at each one or if she just, they just packed them in a bag and she shipped them to me. I bet that's what she did. She doesn't have time to look at all these owls. That one's cool. That's a JJ. Oh, look at this Christmas owl. It is missing a little gem, but who cares? It's so cute. Oh my goodness. These are great. Oh, cool. This is something that somebody made and it's got an owl and a key. So this would be considered, um, oh, what do you call that? I lost, I lost it. I can't, I can't think of it. This one is just a trinket. This one is a pendant. Ooh, but he's cool. Look at that. Wow. That is cool. That's some sort of clip. Huh, that's neat. This one I think is ceramic, handmade porcelain, or porcelain. I meant to say porcelain, I meant porcelain. So cool. Uh, this one's Avon. I wonder if it glows in the dark. It looks like it might glow in the dark. Oh, look at this guy. He's another JJ. Got this one. Oh, it's got a swan. I bet that's Savorsky. I can never say it. <gasps> Ooh, pretty. Look at that. Okay, is Terry not the best? She's the best. That one signed something. She found me all these owls and she negotiated a price for me. And that was so kind of her. That one is Mamselli. Cute. Oh, that's gotta be front and center. Oh my goodness, it matches the lamp. That is stunning. I can't tell if it's signed or not. It looks like there's a little mark on the inside. Look at this guy. Cute. Oh, look. Whoa. He moves. He's cute too. So I'll have to figure out like exactly what I'm looking for, for the, um, the lamp. Cause I don't know, I might have more than I need and I may be able to sell some of these. Maybe I'll bring them to whatnot. Look at that. That is cool. Wonder if that's Amber. I don't know. I doubt it, but that would be sweet, right? Wow. That is a cool one. I love it. Oh my gosh. These are great. Oh, <gasps> you guys can tell I like the ones with the rhinestones. They are so good. Oh my goodness. Cute, cute. Look at this one. I'll go, I'll go through these more in depth later. Oh, look at this. And it's chained to this one. Whoa. Huh, that looks like it could be sterling, but I don't see any markings. There's another blinger. Cute, didn't I have another one like, oh, no, blue eyes. Red eyes. That one looks like a trafari. Is it? It is Crown Trafari. I called it. I called it. I have another owl that reminds me of that one. That's Crown Trafari. That's what made me think of it. Look at that. That kind of looks like a parrot. That is blingy and so pretty. Oh, this is a wise owl with his glasses. That one's signed also. I can't read it. I'm really brave sticking my hand inside here without a, a glove on. Oh, bummer. That one's missing a gem. 
That is so cool. I think it'll be okay. Look at that, the owl face. Are these rad or what? Oh, look at this one. That looks like it could be sterling also. That's an old pin. Wow. Are these incredible or what? Look at that. Oh my gosh. Wow. I am like beyond belief right now at the amazingness of these brooches. Look at this one. Look at this little guy. I think I have enough for the lampshade, you guys. Do you think I'm crazy putting them on a lampshade? I think it's gonna be so cool. That one's signed something down there. Little gold Tony. Oh, wow, look at that. That dude is huge. Wow, I wonder what that's even made of. Do you think my lamp is going to tip over? I think it might. I'm a little nervous. These are all so great. He's missing an eyeball. Cute. This one is marked made in Taiwan. Wow, what a great friend Terry is, seriously, to take her time to do this for me and send these to me and package it so well. I mean, everything made it safe. She's probably, she messaged me yesterday. She's like, it says it's going to arrive tomorrow. I'm like, I know I checked it today. We're both like, she's like, I hope I made it. I hope it made it safe. And I knew like Terry ships amazing big stuff all the time. And uh, she's really, really really a great reseller so uh she's one of the biggest bolo finders i've ever seen ever so we've i've talked about her on my channel so so much mindful recycle and she will be linked down below so make sure you guys go and follow her what's this one say it's uh wild bird that is a brand they make a lot of animal jewelry i do know that come across those before oh i love this one it's a heart it has a heart belly. Wow. Some of these um, could just be unsigned, but are by a maker. So if anybody recognizes anything, shout it out in the comments. Look at that guy. Oh my goodness. These are incredible. Wow. Uh, I probably would have bought so much stuff if I would have been at this sale. Oh. Wow. Wow. Look how pretty they are. They're incredible. I hope you guys aren't bored. There is no way anybody is bored because this is so fun. I think this is hinged. Does this, this open? I think it might open. Oh! <laughs> is it a lip gloss? You know what? It might be um, like a perfume. I wonder if it's vintage Avon. It's not marked Avon. I'll have to see if I can find that one, just out of curiosity. Look at that. Wow. That has something written on it. Whoa. Let's see how many times I can drop it. The pin says something. Oh, that one says Avon. So some sort of plastic, it looks like. Um, I'm not sure what that one says, but it's got the little glasses that go up and down. Oh, it's eyes move. That is hilarious. That one's Avon also. I love it. This is going to be the most awesome lamp ever. Um, uh, Marbella. That's another, um, I have two of those. So I'll probably sell one of those. Look at that. Is that a graduation owl? Oh my gosh, they just keep coming. I 
think I've found this one before. I think it's hinged and I think you put something in it. It's really a cool owl. I don't know if I have that one downstairs or not. Uh, I think that's a Monet. Another pretty, pretty one. Ooh, look at the pearls. Oh my goodness. That one's signed also, it looks like, in the middle. I'll have to see what that says. So if I guess if I find a brooch that's worth like a ton of money, I'd probably sell it to help pay for this uh, project. But this is something that I've been wanting to do for a while. And look at that. It's, it's perfect. It's perfect. That one's got a piece of abalone in it. Looks like it might be signed. I'm not sure. Oh, look at them eyeballs. Wow. That one's pretty. Look at this guy. He is 1970. Can you guys read that? What's it say? Hong Kong berries, maybe? Look at that one. Oh, it's a bobblehead. Wow. Pretty pink one there. That is a pendant. Here's another one sitting on a branch. So there's two of those. Those might look cute side by side. Oh, isn't this from a movie or something? I don't know if it is. I mean, it's definitely a vintage brooch. That one's just a little guy. He's cute. Ooh, love that one. Cute. I think he might be missing his belly. All right, let's see. Ouch. Get this one and then look at this this looks really old oh so cool these are so so cool i could not be happier what a great purchase wow and what a great friend for doing this for me you guys there's not many people in the world that are awesome awesome and terry is awesome I mean, there's a lot of awesome people, but she really went out of her way to do this for me. And that was just super kind. What a gift. Oh, there's another one of those guys. And let's see, I think, oh, you guys, guess what? Wait until you see this. Okay, there's another owl. But there are some, uh, I think there's some rhinestones. So look, oh, we got one more here. But we've got this rhinestone, this that probably fits on something. And I think I saw a green one in there. Let me pull them out. Okay, so this green one right here, I think it goes to this guy. Looky there. Yep. So I can have my husband glue that back in for me. That is awesome because that was really amazing. This guy was missing. This might go with him. But I think he's missing two. And then where was that one? I had that one and I'm like, I think he's missing his belly. Right here. I think this goes right here. So I can glue that back in. Looky there. And then these are just um, some smaller ones. So I'm gonna put these in a little baggie. And as I do this, I can uh, find my husband's glue and uh, or have him help me. He's really good with like working um, with tweezers and small things where I, my eyeballs, I have glasses and it is super hard for me to do any of that. So I will more than likely have him do that. All right, you guys stay tuned for the finished project. Do you guys see it? There's a glow now. <gasps> Let's see what glows. Ooh. Let's turn it. Can we turn it? See if anything glows over here. Some of it's just paint, some of it's stones. How fun is this? Look at that orange one. Whoa. 
that's cool. Whoa, look at that one's eyes. <laughs> oh my goodness. I just had to. Just had to see if anything glowed. Some of these are paint, but man, that looks cool, right? Let's keep going. That one's painted. Oh, look at the green eyes on that owl. There's the glow-in-the-dark owl. Okay. Ooh, look at that belly. That's cool. That one's glowing green. I think that might be amber. It's orange. Look at the green eyes on that one. I'll show you guys everything without the black light here in a minute. Did we do the whole thing? Are we back at the beginning? Oh, they're so cool. They're so cool. Wow. So there are some little holes that I still need to fill in. This one here, I'll tell you when I turn the light on. Wait until you see them in the light, you guys. They're awesome. Okay, so here is our old school record player. And here it is, you guys. Dun, dun, dun. So really, I can turn it whichever way I want. Because it has the ability to turn. So I can get different views of the different owls. Is that cool or what? Now there are some little holes like right here and right here. I'd like to find like the little uh, pins, not a brooch, but like little pins to fill in these areas. But overall, I think it looks amazing. And I even had brooches left over. So I'm gonna be selling some of those. And I absolutely love it. I got this one from Farm Girl Scavenger Noel. Some of these I bought on Whatnot from Lisa Source. And Noelle sent me a couple as a gift. I'm trying to find them. Oh my goodness, they all blend in. Noelle sent me this one. And I'm not sure if I'm gonna remember what, oh, I think this one right here as a gift. So, and then I bought this one from her Whatnot, which it's a uh, signed brooch. It's really awesome. And the ones from Lisa Source, I cannot remember. I think there's three or four on here from her whatnot. So be sure to go and give her a follow. But turned out amazing. I absolutely love it. Let's turn it on and see what it looks like on. It works. Oh, look how pretty it is. And shout out to Donatella Bottolino. This was her idea. And Mindful Recycle for helping me find all the brooches and the lamp. Oh my goodness, I absolutely love it. I'm super, super excited. I can't wait to see this on at night. And thank you guys so much for being here. And thank you for sharing this owl journey with me. Ooh, look at that one. That's cool. All right, you guys, thanks for watching. So you're probably wondering, or maybe you're not, do I have any owls left? Did I use them all or did I save some for my whatnot show? <gasps> I may have saved a few for my whatnot show. Do you guys want to see what I have left? Okay, so here is just a small preview of some of the owls that I will eventually be bringing to whatnot. I don't know when. Um, this one here is like a little trinket, so I couldn't really use that on the lamp. This one is also a trinket. It's so beautiful. This one was something that I had just had. I was thinking about making a necklace out of it, but I may bring it to whatnot. I haven't quite decided yet. These were pendants. Like, look at this. Look at that owl. I mean, these are really, really sweet. And I think this one's a pendant. That one's a brooch. This one is, I don't know what this is. I forget, somebody told me in a show once. So pretty cool stuff left. This one is beautiful. This one's something that somebody made. It was just so big um, and I used some other big ones. So I felt like maybe it didn't, um, it was too big for the lamp, but there are some really good ones left. This one was from another batch that I had and this one here was from another batch I had. And I had some extra rhinestones here. So um, I was trying to figure out what they went to. But the googly eyes, ugh, I was really hoping to fit him on there. I love those. And I have two of those. But just some really cute stuff left. So, yeah, if you guys want me to bring these to Whatnot, let me know down in the comments. Say bring them to Whatnot. 
And if you guys aren't following me on whatnot, uh, there's a link down below. You can join and get $15 to shop with my referral link down there. And if you're already on whatnot, just go find Bolo Buddies, all lowercase, and bookmark my upcoming shows. Look at that one. That one's signed. Hmm. So, yeah, when I sorted these at the beginning, you guys saw that I did not do a very good job of looking through and seeing what was branded and not. Look at this big guy. He is huge. He's, like, huge. So cool. All right, so if you like owls, put owl in the comments. Thanks for watching. Hey, Bolo Buddies. I hope you enjoyed this show. I sure did enjoy making that owl lamp, kind of. <laughs> My thumb is so sore. Oh my goodness. So I told Terry, I was like, she asked me, like I think I told this earlier, I said, I really want a nice vintage thick lampshade, you know, that's double layered and really, really, you know, a good one. <laughs> well, my thumb sure felt it trying to push those pins through that two layers. Ah! So anyway, um, but honestly, if it wasn't a nice, big, awesome lampshade, I don't think that it would have held the weight of the brooches. So it just worked out perfectly. I'm so excited about it. Again, thank you so much, Terry Mindful Recycle. If you guys are not following her, she is one of the biggest bolo money, bolo money. Oh my goodness. She is one of the biggest bolo finders, big money bolo finders that I know. She finds the best stuff and her what sold videos, I'm telling you what, are top notch. So go sub her up. And Terry, if you're watching, thank you again so much. I appreciate you.